Hello and welcome to another edition of Keeping It Honest. I'm your host, Sarah Dukes. Now, over the weekend, I came across information that you probably need to know about. Now, remember Obamacare and how it got passed by the president and went to see the court, got upheld and whatever. Now, there was a big rumor that, oh, by March 2013, there's going to be shifts to our risk. So the government to track us and whatever they need to do. Now, for the record, the bill is 1,990 1, pages long. Now, nobody's not going to sit read through 1,990 pages. So, I got two mostly good important facts from the bill, which I have here. And it basically said this. Page 50 in Section 2, the bill will provide the bill Obamacare will provide insurance to U.S. residents even if they are not here illegally. And on page 58, Section 59, that the government will have real-time access to any individual's bank and will have the authority to make electronic rulings. Now, it says nowhere in the two facts I just found in Obamacare. Nowhere it says that, oh, we're going to implant a chip into your wrist to track you and monitor you like some type of slave. So if you're thinking that something like that's going to happen, it's not. It's not, okay? So we can all stop freaking out, stop panicking that we're going to be mindless zombies with chips implanted to us and not be our own individuals. So y'all can stop that. Now, don't, don't think that anymore. Just stop. Because we all know the day that happens is the day that hell will freeze us over. Okay, so stop. Don't think about it anymore. Stop. Okay, just stop it. Just, you, are you stopping? Okay, good. So, this is, this is what you need to know. No chip, risk, March 2013. The conspiracy theory, dead. Done. Alright? Cool. Just need to get that done out there. For this edition of Keeping It Honest, I'm Daryl Dukes. Have a nice day.